Hello, 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 everyone. So we were having a little technical difficulty, but we're here now. And I'm gonna, Nikisha's here. There's Nikisha. Okay, there's Nikisha. Hey. We're just waiting on Thea to jump on. We were having a little bit of a technical difficulty. I don't know what happened. The, the thing got erased or whatever. But hi, everyone. This is our first live of 2019. I'm so excited. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Hey, yeah. Let's see here. You know, I always like to look at us on our on my phone. I'm trying to get there to see. I'm on the phone trying to see us on the computer here. Let's see if I can. It's always like um it is always like a few seconds behind. Oh okay. you know, which is weird for me. Okay, so here comes Thea and then Black Mama number three is here. There we go. Okay, so do you all like this look? Because you know I can get really fancy with it. You know I can get really super duper fancy. We I want to fancy on my phone. I can only just see us in a boring way. Let me pull up the we site. We can do this. Uh -oh, um, we, we can do this. Boom, 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 boom. Hi, Alicia Michelle. Of course <laughs> you're here. Of course Alicia Michelle is here. Hey, boo, hey. Hey, girl, girl, you know you had started some stuff with your question, Alicia Michelle. She sent the John Gray question and the spanking question. So it was had, it was what it was. It was. Right. It was some stuff. It was some stuff. She has it started was. a little bit of stuff. So hey, boo. And she's also a big shout out to her because she's also our first patron. So yeah. big, yeah. big shout out to Can her. Thanks, girl. Can I put water in here? Yeah. This is my baby, y'all. He's my hey. um, Q baby is out of town, so it is just me holding it down. Hi, um, Houston doula. Hi, I boo. see you, boo. <laughs> I see you. I see you. Thank you for joining us. So, drop your questions if you have um, any questions for us. Um, Thea, what does your mug say? Oh, all good things are wild and free. All good things are wild and free. I like that. I like that. Mm -hmm. So today, just I like to give like a little podcast setup so people won't think that it's all fancy and all magic. So um, <laughs> we're it's because it's really not like it's really work. So we're using um, Be Live to go live stream. Be Live TV to go live in Facebook. I'm not really liking. I'm not feeling this look. So you want to make it fancier? I'm trying to make it fancier. I I just feel like we can't see everyone's full face. Um, okay. I'm not feeling. I'm not. I don't know. I'm not feeling this. Maybe I'll click on other people when they start. When you, I don't know. I'm not feeling like, this. How are y'all like, feeling about it? I get my angle right. Oh, we have a comment. Anya Dula. Hey, boo. Hey, can you guys hear us? Say yes if you can hear us. Type yes so I can make sure that you all can hear us well. Type yes for me if you can hear us. Um. So. Uh, Hi, okay, at least Michelle said hi as well. Type, hey, type yes if you can hear us for me. I wanna make sure that uh, we can be heard clearly. So we go through Be Live TV. I'm not, they're not a sponsor, but I just wanna let y'all know like how we, oh, hey, boo, hey, cute baby's here, hey. <laughs> um, so, but please type yes um, if you all can hear us, just so we can make sure that we sound good. Make sure. Okay, thank you, thank you. They can hear us. So, um, so yeah, we do it through Be Live TV, and then today my lighting is I got the ring light. I got the ring light. So that's what's making me shimmer. Plus the Fenty makeup is doing its thing. Fenty. The Fenty makeup is doing its thing. Okay, so let's just um, jump right in and talk about, um, uh, we can talk about any episode that we've done. I wanna say a little bit about uh, episode uh, 21 with- um, With Fenty first, I have a complaint with Fenty. What's your complaint with Fenty? Wait, 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 wait. Can I we just wait, don't Nikisha, know. I don't think we should go know. public with, with Fenty complaints <laughs> until we, what if they're one day a sponsor? No, it's, it's, not, it's not bad. Talk, it's not bad. Talk about okay. Fake 23. Okay, oh, what do you go say? ahead. Talk about episode 23. I'm not done okay. editing that one yet. They've been hearing me talk about episode 23 all week. Because I'm not done editing that one yet. Okay. 
Okay, so what's what's the complaint about Fenty? This is the second time I've gotten to the bottom of the container and didn't know the bottom was coming. It tricked me. Mm -hmm. I'm like, <laughs> oh no, because it's it looks it looks full the whole time you're using it. I you know, didn't case, know that's that. a good hint because that's a good tip though, because I didn't I, know that. Neither, and I might need to restock before my oh, trip. So, so, so the brown, so the brown. Hey, Jessica, how you doing? Um, so, so it's that color the whole time through. I didn't know that. It is, Ooh. girl. It is. And you know, I'm good to you know. I I just switched over to Fenty. I was. Yes, you are. You are an overuser of product. I, well, not only that, but I'm a I'm a brand loyalist. So I was with Mac rubbing around the edges of my powder case and I was like let me go get some new makeup and so then I did Fenty. Yes. Um but no too, girl but, but that oh thank you boo thank you thank okay. you so I want to talk a little bit about episode 21 which is Black Mama Feminist with Jamila Lemieux. Do you all but we can start with episode you know 22 because that's our latest ask us anything. So you all have any comments about episode 22? Have you gotten any feedback from people about episode 22? Us or the or the or the watchers? You both you and the oh. watchers. Oh, okay. I can't see their comments. I don't know if oh maybe I can see. Like it's I'll be able to read them. I'll be able okay. to read them. Yeah. Uh oh. Wait, but have you gotten any oh. have you gotten any oh, okay. comments about episode 22? I feel like Q Baby's uh a comment looks like a, a warning. I I'm am watching, watching you. I am you watching. Know, you know, I ain't never scared. So, <laughs> oh, oh, wait, I mean, wait. I love him with all my heart. I truly oh, do. No. But he, you know, he knows what you were here for the wedding. He knows what he got into. Oh. You, you were here. You were here. I was, was a witness. There. I was you were a witness. witness. But do we have any? Did you guys get any feedback about um, episode twenty-two? I got. You know, yes, I did. Okay, Nikisha always gets feedback. I mean, you, you were here. You oh, that's okay. Go ahead. That's you. Okay. Yeah, that's me. That was my phone. That's really loud. My bad. Okay. I'm getting a little freer. I'm getting a little freer with my okay in the show. You are. You are. A couple of my colleagues ended up listening and it was like, "Hold up." Was uh -huh. that you that had said, and I was like, "Yes, yes, it was. <laughs> I had said it." And so, you know, I mean, it is what it is. I got a little free. Oh, well, are you are you referring to the are you referring to the first question? Yes. The first question. Yes, so the first question in the episode was about a relationship. And um mm -hmm. hi Jolina, hi Tashara. Mm -hmm. Um and you know, the person in uh the person who wrote the letter said that their partner they had not had uh oral sex in, you know. Like never, like one time. Thank and so Nikisha, yeah, you. Nikisha gave. Well, you know, I'm I'm trying. I'm doing my best. Um, yeah. So because you know, I wanted to say something I else. Yeah. So Nikisha's advice uh, was to, I mean, you know, well, Nikisha just gave some really blunt advice, and it's actually really good advice. In my oh, opinion. that was like, oh yeah, find yeah. the face to sit on. Yeah, okay. find the face. Okay. okay, well, Thea already said it. She I advised said, her I, to okay. find the face to sit on. I so I like, thought that was solid advice. I thought that. Was. Uh, Alicia Michelle says the black feminist one. I don't feel guilty for spending twenty dollars on Instacart. <laughs> <laughs> no, and you shouldn't. Um, nor should you. Nor should uh, you ever. No. Anya Dula said, episode 22, I usually tell my kiddo to put his earbuds in. I didn't. And suddenly, oh. the no. <laughs> he, my God, boo. My said God. It. She didn't have to say it like that, but she said it. <laughs> my bad. Thank you, Anya Dula. So what we'll do from now on is I he promise. He politely leaned over. <laughs> put those put earbuds <laughs> Because you never know. Because you never know. Just put a little disclaimer on the front. Just put some earbuds in the baby. Oh, my bad. My bad, boo. My bad. I it's will. Uh, the same thing. Dang, to you know the what? Same thing. Y'all, so we need to put up a thing that says, if you are listening, put in them earbuds. <laughs> to show us that. We I normally some... listen with my earbuds, but not episode 22. And bam, pissy ball. <laughs> we, need, we need some them black mama earbuds. We do. We do. We do. But I put a disclaimer. disclaimer. 
No, I episode. did put a disclaimer at the very top of the show when I do my introduction, which tells me that they're skipping my introduction. <laughs> no shade. No shade. They're going straight to the mac and cheese. Throughout, throughout. Yeah, I, we may have to do it during the mac and cheese as well. We may have to do it during the mac and cheese as well. My bad. My bad. Arm My yourself bad. with earbuds. My bad. My bad. Oh, God. I'm sorry you all had that experience. Oh, man. That just would have been... Oh, man. Well, sorry about it, that. It is what you know. But now we know. We'll do a disclaimer before the mac and cheese as well. <laughs> to let... Yeah. To, to let folks well, know. we will say... For episode, what is that one? Twenty. For episode twenty three, you just earbuds. want the, you just, just earbuds. Earbuds. You you just want the ear for the next episode we drop it. You want the earbuds the whole time. The whole you, time because because it's about Talk black about. mamas. That, look at the Keisha shaking her head. It's about black okay. mamas and pleasure. So you want the earbuds on. Uh, you want the earbuds on the whole time. Yeah. Um. Okay, so any more feedback? That was good. Alicia Michelle put outsource it. She listened to episode 21. Let me outsource tell you though, that set me free because yeah. Well, even like I mean, we even well let me like, just let me give a little let me give a little background. So in episode 21, we had our guest was Jamila Lemieux, and she and we and Thea asked her, what advice would you give to uh moms? And her advice was whatever you can outsource outsource it and so that's what alicia michelle is talking about because now yeah. she's she spent 20 dollars on instacart and she's outsourcing and, and so me, I've, I've been really thinking about this in a lot of ways you know I, I i beyonce is the standard right and so i'm i'm pretty sure that they have like full-time brown o'clock folks yeah what? like more than and, one and i more remember than you one, think probably. about that in terms of like just leisure but what i realize now when because all of us are working really hard on different projects mm -hmm. is that having people to take care of those things that take energy gives you more energy to create so mm -hmm. now i'm like associating that with um i'm associating that with how do i create create more free time for myself that could be going towards creating and that may be you know it's not bougie to like hire somebody put money in that person's pocket right yeah. to give yourself more creative freedom i also think too thea it helps us show up and be more present as parents mm -hmm. yeah because when you have oh, yeah this is about children too I forget. yeah we <laughs> I, forget. I forget about the kid there's when you right. when when I I have more energy when I order my groceries online and all I got to do is go pick them up. You feel me? Mm -hmm. So I I think that it it gives you more. It gives you you can be more focused and present with your children if you're not thinking about all the other thousands of things that you have to do. To so Sean, um, let me tell you. I see your comments, Sean. Let me tell you something. You know, we do get judged as bougie for that, but I'll tell you, I had. Someone cleaning my house twice a month when I lived on my own. And I miss that bitch every day. Okay? <laughs> I miss her every day. Yeah. I, ever since then, I'm gonna tell you something. Yeah, no, I feel we'll like talk. I feel resentful that I have no. to take a break from my yeah. my creative energy to clean wash a dish. Mm -hmm. And I, I miss her. I don't miss a lot of people in my life, but I miss her. And so I'm going to be bougie and get her back. That's what I'm going for 2019. And really, around my house after yours. Mm -hmm. And really, when you have that clean house and that clean space, it yeah, also it just better. frees up a lot of energy. Yeah. You know what I'm it's saying? Yeah. 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 It really does. Yeah. Um, Linda, no, what is it? Lydia Boyd. I'm yeah. one of Nikki's colleagues. That's oh, what she said. Lydia. 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 <laughs> the kitchen said, oh, Lydia. Oh, Lydia. Back up, oh. Lydia. Back up, Lydia. <laughs> but wait, but wait. I knew you was one of Nikisha's uh, colleagues when you said pearl clutching. <laughs> Lydia My said, people don't even I have pearl of, pearls. I'm one of Nikki's Lydia. colleagues, and it was a pearl clutching <laughs> moment. <laughs> But but it was good advice though, wasn't it, Lydia? Nikisha's, it was good advice Nikisha's, though. Nikisha's existence, y'all, is like the Marvel universe. Like there are literally beings that never come into contact. So when they come into contact, it's like some interstellar. Uh, Look at her it face. Is. It is. Okay. It is. 
It Come is. back, Lydia. We love this. We love this. It is. We love it. So, oh, then she yeah. said, oh, this is. She so, said, Nikki is always telling me I need to censor myself. Oh, ah! Lydia, you are welcome on all of our lives. Do you hear me? You know we what? want this you is, here every time. Like, we want like, you here every time. This is like when black men like try to keep their exes and their new new women apart. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and they're like, they fear like some cataclysmic. Shit is gonna go down at these two in the same space. This is what's happening to the Keisha right now. I oh, know. I love it. I love we Lydia. How do we get her a t-shirt? You know what I mean? You're supposed to just watch in silence. We'll just lose the silence. Okay. Lydia is up on the thread. I love it. Lydia said, I'll be here. Lydia said, I'll be here. Lydia said I'll be here. Okay. Highlight right. all our comments. Ooh, Alicia I'm Michelle. So just don't listen to the one that's about to drop. That's all I'm saying. The, the new one. Don't do it. Lydia. I, you know what? I want y'all to know something real. We forget half of what we've said. I don't. Until we, I un- well, she don't. But I think Nikisha and I are often surprised sometimes. Like, we said that? Well, let it roll. Yeah. I don't. Lydia, friend me on Facebook. Crystal no. Daniel Irby. No. And I'll send you the link to our episodes, Lydia. I'll send you a personal link so you'll be there. Alicia Michelle said that unfortunately, she said, I reinvested the energy <laughs> she said, no, oh. into housework. I mean, I don't necessarily think that's a bad thing. I mean, if that's what you wanted to reinvest the energy in, you know what I'm I saying? Think, I don't think she wanted to. Okay, she didn't want to. Alicia, did you want to? Yeah, okay, she didn't want to. Okay, no, she didn't want to. Yeah, then I don't know many people who would save energy and then reinvest it. It's true. Uh, and clean up after but, folks. But sometimes, I think when you, all right, so you got a little free time because you outsource something else, and with mm-hmm. that, that free time, you clean up your space or you organize your space. Mm-hmm. So it's freer in the coming days and weeks when that help is not available. It mm-hmm. can be a favor, but. Alicia Michelle said no. Alicia Michelle said no. <laughs> Wait, I mean, it may not feel rewarding. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I do have my unbothered, unbalanced shirt on too. Yeah. Oh, that's it. Let me, let me highlight you right here. Nikisha, they said they're having a little, a hard time hearing you. Q Baby said he's having a hard time hearing you. I can't see Q Baby's comments. Okay. Um, you text me. That's irrelevant, huh? Okay. Um, it's probably my janky phone. Okay. Oh, you're on your phone. Okay. She's on her phone. Okay. I am. Y'all about to see me drive in a second, but you know. Okay. Don't do it. Um, so yeah. And Alicia Michelle, give yourself some grace. Um, Mm -hmm. you may have to do it in parts. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like now you're doing the Instacart and your next goal is to get somebody to help you with those household chores. Let me tell you one, once a month to change your life. Just even once a month. Yeah, yeah. Um, so yeah, so that was a lot of episode twenty one. One of my favorite quotes from episode twenty one was when Jamila said that um um black women are the original feminist. Yeah. And so she, you know, that's why she uh that's why she holds on to that title, uh, as opposed to womanist. So that was one of my favorite um quotes from there. Um, I think one of my well, I know my absolute favorite moment in episode 22 is when Thea said mm. 10,000 ancestors would leap from my body. It was such a visual. It was such, such a visual. visual. It hurt. Partner. And I wasn't going to say anything. Remember, I was like, I'm not no, going to talk about this. I'm not going to talk about this. I wasn't going to give it any time. But um, if her partner was doing what Beastman's partner was doing, and so and you know they got a reality show, they got a reality show. Uh, they what? do. They do. Yeah. They got a reality show. Everybody was doing all that. Oh, but you, you know, you don't know if you've been a caregiver. And I was like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And then I'm boom, doing, I'm doing my Michael Scott awkward face. Mm-hmm. Let me tell you something. I knows what I knows when I knows it. Okay. Yeah, 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 that's problematic. That's problematic. Um, and then my other one of the things that we got a lot of reaction from is when I posted the clip about love, and that love shouldn't be about sacrifice, but it should be about expansion. And this was actually uh, from Alicia Michelle's question about John Gray saying that 
his wife raised him. Mm -hmm. Um, and, uh, you know, and, and my reaction to that was black women in particular are taught to basically be Jesus and sacrifice ourselves (laughs) and lay down on the altar, you know, for all these other people. But my thought is, well, if Jesus already did it, we ain't got to do it. My other thought is that when people use Jesus as the ultimate symbol of sacrifice, the thing that I always say is, but Jesus didn't die. Jesus didn't die. So the ultimate sacrifice- And and he didn't want to. Yeah, well, the ultimate sacrifice was that he ended up expanding. His spirit ended up expanding. And so to me, that symbolizes what love, you know, is supposed to do and what love is supposed to be about. And we got a lot of- um, reaction from that. And the quote that I used in the post that I did was from Bell Hooks, All About Love, love. which is, listen, listen, people, listen. I know Bell Hooks throws a lot of shade at Beyonce. I know, I know. But that don't wipe out a lot of the work that she's done. And All About Love is one of the best books that I have ever read. And it really changed. um, Yeah. It, it impacted the way that I raised my children. It impacted me in relationships. Um, and so if you can read, if you can get your hands on that book, All About Love, please, please, please read that book. Um, because that, uh, I realized that I knew a lot about um, everything else, you know, mm. except, you know, and, and not, at, I knew, I even knew a lot about self-love, but not a lot about, uh partnership and relationship yeah. love. And well, she I, gives a working definition of love. She gives a working definition. That, that, that's something yeah. she spends a lot of time on in the book. It's like talking about the fact that there really isn't a great working definition of it. Mm-hmm. Um, so she gives one and differentiates between care and love. Yeah. Um, really, really is really helpful. It's very helpful. Yeah. But I would say about that sacrifice comment that and if, it, if in addition to being your wife, I had to raise you. And you're going to bring this trial up, up in my house. Yeah. I'm just saying. If she want to turn into Octavia Butler and Ma, I don't, I don't feel nothing about that. <laughs> I'm with I'm, you on it. I'm with you. Octavia Spencer. If she, if she want to turn to Octavia Spencer and Ma and start popping up out of closets and shit, I ain't mad about it. It is what it is. It is what it is. Oh, my sister's here. Hi, my sister's here. Hi, hi. Leslie. My sister's here. Hi. Um, yeah. So I, you know, I don't believe that love is about sacrifice. I believe that love is about expansion. Yeah. And that, you know, and that's been uh I think. Uh, one of the greatest things about marriage, because I wasn't a person who was necessarily looking to get married. Um, and uh, it's been one of the it's, it's been one of the one of the greatest things and such a, um, ex, you know, expansion experience for me in a really, 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 really good way. So. So, yeah. So that was so those were the two things that got the most uh, feedback. Um, from the episode. Did you guys have any more comments on the episode? I'm really excited yeah. about the ones coming out too. Yeah, I know, we can't, I know we're not supposed to. Well, no, we can we can do a little tease. We can do a little tease. You so then, wanna, um, you might need to repeat this for me if the audience can't hear me. But I wanted to know what they thought about us having a guest. Um, mm-hmm. yeah, yeah, good point. So it's- format it was different energy to have a you know a fourth person mm-hmm. on the I wonder what they thought of it. Mm-hmm. Yeah so drop that in the comments. What did you for those of you all who listened to episode 21 with Jamila with Jamila Lemieux I thought Nikisha was saying something with Jamila Lemieux let us know what you all thought about us having a guest because she was our very first guest. We've never had a guest yeah. um, before so let us know um uh let it, let us know what you guys uh, thought about her. Well, not what you thought about her, but what but how you felt about us having a guest, the energy and the format um, of the show. But while we're waiting on those comments, we can tease a little bit about the what's coming up. Did you want to talk about them, Via? Yeah, you want me to? Well, I make th- well, yeah. So we have the pleasure one, which you know, mm-hmm. for those of you who've um, 
seen the other work I do, I do a lot of work around pleasure and uh, joy and decolonizing that and reclaiming that uh, in the black body. I'm actually leaving this week for the next part of my sex therapy. And y'all remember that episode when I came back was kind of lit. We had a lot of going on. Um, so I look forward to be able to bring some of that back. Yeah. And we're calling it pleasure because initially we were going to, it was going to be about black moms and sex. And I started doing some research and uh, it was just uh, problematic. The, the, Googles, the Googles was just yeah. problematic when you yeah. Google black moms and sex. I don't even know why I did that. I shouldn't have even did that. Uh, but when I Googled white moms and sex, that same stuff didn't come up. Please. Just saying, Google, you might want to get on that. Yeah, we'll check it out. But, um, so, but we wanted to call it pleasure because we also felt like you can get tips and tricks, you know, anywhere, but if you don't, and, and you can actually be great at sex and not center your own pleasure and not center your own needs. So we really, really wanted to focus on centering your pleasure, your wants, your needs, and how being a mother has impacted your ability or lack of ability to do that. So that's the next episode that's dropping. Um, and yeah. So, then, so yeah, because a lot because a lot of my work centers around there. It's also about like removing pleasure from just being viewed phys as mm -hmm. physical. Um, mm -hmm. And so, um, so yeah, I, I, I'm looking forward to you all having questions about that and experiencing that because that ties into the work I do um, in other in other areas. And then, can we tell them what the last one was? Or is that too? Yeah. But, no, no, that's fine. But real quick, I wanted to say with episode 22, uh, no, with episode 23, the next episode dropping, we'll have a playlist. It's called Save the Fire. Save the Fire. And so we're going to have Save the some, Fire. Yeah, always Yay. first out in songs Yay. and whatever we're doing. So I if you, it's Stephanie Mills. So if I catch with that one, with episode 23, there's going to be. Um, a lot more, a more shocking moment, more shared from us. It's English it's an earbuds character. episode. It's an earbuds episode. Earbuds. Oh, we should have earbuds episode. What do you say? Earbud episodes. Earbud episodes. Earbud episode. Earbud episode. Earbud episode. Uh, but I think there's going to be a lot of aha moments. You will really start to view sex mm -hmm. differently. Yeah. Like mm -hmm. you, we'll come back and we'll ask you after how you, uh, what you take away from sex, what you take yeah. away from, from and, pleasure. And even when we were prepping for like, so because the work I do after that, Crystal actually gets to see, I don't know if Nikisha got to see it. Wait, is Nikisha talking? The She's like in here. I couldn't hear. Can you hear? What were you oh. saying, Nikisha? I didn't say anything else. I don't think. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> you know, I was saying that um, I, I did this thing on erotophobia and I'm doing a, like kind of a series on it, on pleasure. But um, when we really unpack it, like we cannot separate black sexuality and pleasure from the from the impact of colonization. And so, you know, we gonna do we gonna do more deep dives. Yeah. It is what it is, because it, to me, it's a part of our decolonization and a part of our reclaiming of our birthright to have um, joy and pleasure in our lives. It's not something I feel like we have to wait 10 lifetimes to get, mm -hmm. I, and that's just ridiculous. And um, when I talk about us getting free this lifetime, this is part of the pathway that we're talking about. So I, I was really excited that, you know, and I'm hoping, I want black women to look at it as a right, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you know, not as a luxury. Mm -hmm. It's not a luxury. It is, it is your actual physical, mental, emotional, spiritual birthright. And not having it is, you know, is um, is a tool of, of colonization. I think she'll be back. I think mm -hmm. she's probably going to get on the computer. Okay. Um, Thank you. For that. Thank you. Uh, there is some lag on Nikki's feet. Okay. Yeah, we're get. I think that's why she dropped out, and she's going to come back. Um, Tashara says. Uh, she says, I enjoyed having the guests. It was interesting to listen to you all's dynamic as a group along with someone new. Thank you. Uh, Lydia said, this is a serious interest of mine. I'm excited to hear about it. I think she's Lydia, the more the you comment, Lydia, Lydia, the more I'm Lydia, like, the more Lydia. I'm like, I need to know Lydia. Lydia, yes. I need to know her. Um, Tashara said, Cassandra Hughley, the podcast I listen to. Can you tell us more about that? I'm not familiar with that. Can you tell us more about Cassandra Hughley uh, and that podcast? Um, let's see. Oh, uh, 
Alicia Michelle says, black life and black motherhood is all earmuffs. You know what, Alicia? <laughs> you might be right, boo. You mm -hmm. might be right, boo. You might be right. But we're going to do that hashtag earbud episodes. So that's the episode that's dropping next is the episode about black moms and pleasure. And then the episode after that is also really excited about on spirituality, where we take a look back at episode four, which is how I made it over. And that episode is about spirituality. And we look at where we were then as opposed to where we are now. And that episode was super powerful. Um, we're going to have some exclusive content for our patrons from that episode because it was a, the recording was two and a half hours. Mm -hmm. And so we don't want an episode that's two and a half hours. Two and a half hours. Because sometimes we have a two and a half hours that's just like us, mess, us cutting up. Yeah, yeah, but this, this was, was a solid. solid. This, this was, was a solid. solid. Yeah, and so we'll have uh, some. We'll put some of that content in our Patreon and make it exclusive for our uh, for our for our uh, for our patrons. Oh, Cassandra. Oh, thank you, Moose. She was trying to tag her friend. She was trying oh. to tag her friend. It's oh, thank, thank you. you. We're, that's what we're talking about. Share the Black Mama magic. Thank you so much. We always encourage people to share with at least one person. I know yeah. everyone is a big um, with sharing on social media. So if you can just share it with one person, we greatly, greatly, greatly um, appreciate it. So that's what we got coming up. Um, our Patreon page is up. Yes. So if you want to become a patron, I'll drop that link as well. Please, you know, um, you can start as little as $2 a month. And uh, we go up from there to help us build a sustainable platform. And so that we can, we, I always say we want to be black mama built. We don't want to have to go to outside sources, outside of our culture, outside of our right. community. We want you all, um, want, uh, we want you all to build us because we want to, we want to be accountable to you all. So I'll drop that link. If you can't become a patron, buy some merchandise at our Teespring store. I'll have that link as well. And also um, you can give a one dollar, I mean, you can give a one-time donation um, through PayPal, but we wanna be sustainable. We're expanding creatively. Um, in June, we're launching Black Mama Creative Week. Yes. Um, and yes. so we'll be talking about what it's like to be a black mama and a creative. Um, so that's something new. That's something all our own that we, uh, did because I think Nikisha's coming back because we really don't want motherhood to be the graveyard of, mm -hmm. of our dreams. And so we want to encourage mothers and show mothers how to pursue their creative dreams during um, motherhood. Tashara says, uh, you're welcome. I share with everyone. I love y'all. Okay. I got to put Nikisha in here because wait, she disappeared. Wait. But I just want y'all to know how busy Nikisha is. But I I, I gotta wait till she goes back so y'all can see this. So y'all can see what she's doing. But um, so yeah, so that's what we're doing. Um, of course, Thea is writing books. I have decided to uh uh make a turn and go into the film industry. Yeah. Uh, and so I'm working on a film now. Should I tell them the name of it? Should I tell them the name of it? No. Okay. Know. Let's wait. I'll let's wait. wait. Okay. I wait. I wait. I wait. I wait. I wait. But let me tell you, it's like extra black. It's extra black and extra southern. It's extra yeah. black and extra southern. That's the way. So, so we're really, really, um, we're really expanding creatively, um, and so we want to encourage you all to do the same. And so that's why we're launching Black Mama Creative Week, yeah. and then from Don't there, give me the whole eight. We have a lot so, of closet creatives. Yeah, I know y'all. A lot of y'all. All of us are closet creatives at some point. So. You know, we wanted to grow out that episode because it was such a popular yeah. episode. And yeah, yeah. came up with the idea of having um, um, a whole week, a whole week about it. So yeah. we're really excited to to share tips and ideas and kind of demystify this because, like, I know it seems like we're doing a lot, and we we we, we are legitimately, mm -hmm. but it's clearly doable. We want to be examples of it being doable versus being like, yeah, you know, yeah. mystic. And and so the and so yeah and I and so that's what the episode that that's what the week will be about. How do you make money while pursuing your creative dreams as a mom? How do you sustain your family and also like the legal side, like getting mm -hmm. yourself getting yourself your your intellectual property protected? Um, hi Alexandra. Mm -hmm. Hi Alexandra. 
Kendra? Oh, she's in our mom group. So, oh, hi. Oh, we from our mom group. Said. So I said, tell us, tell us. Okay. So I think this will, hi, um, Kendra. <laughs> yes. So I think, hi, Charmel. It's beautiful to see you here about everything you're doing. Okay. So I think if I tell them the title, this will hold me accountable. So I just want to be clear. <laughs> As the Jiminy Cricket of Crystal's life, which ain't easy because he is married. If y'all ask for this title, you all are you all are are, are becoming little Jiminy Crickets in this process for Crystal. Okay. So, so the title of the short film that I'm writing is called "Who Got the Body." What? It's called "Who Got the Body." For and my LA people, we don't know what that is, and we're we're kind of not supposed to. Uh, it's about. It is about. Uh, it is about black funerals. That's all I'm gonna say. That's all I'm gonna say. That's I didn't even know. That you, I didn't know that was a thing. That's a thing. Like people, is, I like, know, when somebody died. Y'all taught when, me that. Yeah, when somebody it's died, the first question is, "Who got the body?" Because you don't, you don't want everybody to have your body. It's certain people you want to do your body because you know they can make you look good and they got like a reputation. So the question is, "Who got the body?" You know, when somebody. I died, love so. this. I love so that. that is. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be a ratchet ass mess, and I'm gonna love like every minute of it. Every minute you of it. You know, I do go see Tyler Perry play. You know, I do. I'm good. I it's do gonna go be a ratchet ass mess, and I'm gonna love every minute. And I, the LA kid in me, is gonna be like, "What people do that?" Like that's what always happens. But I, it's gonna so be I, so good. Snot is from the Bay, so she said intrigue. She's from the Bay. So. <laughs> I know, it's not, I know you ain't heard that either. Like that's not something Cali folks said. You know what I'm saying? So we're like. Uh, it's going to be interesting. Uh, Charmel. Oh, hi, I Jermel. can't see it because Jermel, tell Jim I got his shirt on. Charmel, tell Jim I got his shirt on. Keep black. I'm so bad with this. Keep black America great. Tell Jim I got his shirt on. Um, <laughs> Alicia Michelle knows what I'm talking about. She says, ah, uh, yeah, I and, know that's right. She knows listen, what I'm talking about. I can see this being like a 30 minute, like, like how insecure it is. I can see this being like these third or Black Monday. Have you watched Black Monday? With no, Don I haven't Hill watched Black Monday. Hall? It's kind of right. Thank you, Sanat. Okay, thank you. <laughs> thank you. I didn't even know that was fifty percent. I thank you so much at all. So in Cali, we just be like, where are the services? That's what we say. Where are the services? No, no I don't know. We'll ask that no, which funeral home? Which funeral home has the body? Yeah. yeah, is what it means. Yeah, but, right. That's what no. it means. But Thea says that they ask, "Where are the services?" They don't ask who got oh, the body. Cool. They don't ask. That. I didn't even they know to ask. ask. I didn't even they know. Ask that. Hi, Clark Harper. Hey. So that says I don't want just anybody handling my shit either. Oh, I, I know mean, that's right. You know. No. You, no. Can't. No. you cannot. You cannot. But I just didn't know it was. I get the idea. I just didn't know it was called who got. The body. Yeah, and, so, and those are the exact words. Who got the body? Who got the body? Who got, Who the, got body? the body? Yeah. I just yeah. want to. I just want to note, side note here, that Nikisha is now driving. So we have seen Nikisha in her home, and now she is driving somewhere else. And I just this, but this speaks to how busy look Nikisha is. Look at Alicia is. Michelle. Alicia Michelle said that we have to have a thirty-minute conversation about how them over there yes. messed up on me, and we ain't using them no more. <laughs> Culture. Culture. This is just culture. I love that it. That is so true. Or I'm if excited. they if they left the body out too long, because you know. But you know, I don't know if I don't know if I haven't gone to enough funerals, but I feel like we just do the polite thing out here, and we'd be like, yeah. "Did you see that? Did you see? Wait till we get home, no. and then we're like, we'll be like, I know it was a whole thing. No, it's a whole thing. We'll be like, they left them out too long. They have left them out too long, and they and their their skin turn, and so they don't look as good." So yeah, it's a whole thing. But you don't want everybody to have your body. It's true. It's true. So that is what my short film is about. I'm super, super excited. I've started writing it. Um, I've written one section of it. So I'm super excited about that. Um, so, oh, Alicia Michelle, she looked like herself. Don't they always say that? Yes, yes. <laughs> That's the highest compliment. That is the highest, that is compliment, the highest compliment you can give a funeral home is if somebody looks yes. like themselves. She looked like herself. Like no. 
Yeah. 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 Yeah.
No, I really don't. You I just want to be a tree. I, I just want to be a tree. Be a tree. I just want to be a tree. And then I want to be a deemed a, a federal uh, historical Lydia said, Lydia said, Lydia said, and then all the mamas want to sit with the family. <laughs> Clark Harper said, Lydia said, the out the side, the outside kids. Clark Harper said, Kristen trying to start stuff. You know, a funeral, weddings and funerals will break a family up. You know, weddings but and you funerals. also have to have oh, yeah. you also oh, have yeah. to have the person who's non-black that comes to the funeral. Let me tell you, let me tell you, at my brother's wedding, uh, one of my friends sang. And we had like the, the rehearsal dinner. And so she came in and she said, oh, that's so nice of the janitor to eat with us at the rehearsal dinner so that he just doesn't have to clean up. And I said, he's actually not the janitor. He's my sister's boyfriend. And she was like, well, don't get mad at me. I mean, he's the only white person here. What was I supposed to think? <laughs> he's, here to do the, he's here to do the taxes. <laughs> he's here to do everybody's taxes. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, okay, so we love boyfriend. Okay. So, oh, wait, that uh, last thing, last thing. One of the side okay. women have to come in the same dress as the wife. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh! <laughs> did that have to wear the same dress? Yes, she did. Tashara yes, she says, did. who gets to play at what? His main wife or his side wife? Actually, oh, no. Oh, the please. first funeral please. is about that very topic. The mm. first funeral is about that very topic. Yeah, mm. I don't know, at least Michelle. She thought he was a janitor because he was the only white person in the room. I, I assume. Where did she live that she sees white janitors? Because here in LA, they find a brown person somewhere. She's from the bottom. She's from Miami. She's from the bottom. She's from Miami. Ooh, mm. the wife or the sister. Sisters can be complicated. Shout out to my sister in law for marrying my brother in spite of us. Sisters can be complicated. <laughs> I will say that. Shout out to her. She's like, she's a, a she is now you, So now you she have to finish. Smart. So I excited. do. Now I, you have I'm to so excited. I'm so excited. Oh, I'm so excited. So, so you all know um, everything that we have coming up. Uh, I have a webinar called Dear Black Body coming up on March 15th. It's absolutely free. If you need CEUs, uh, you can get CEUs by attending the webinar. I'll drop the link from that. Thea, what do you have coming up? Uh, on my Patreon, I have the erotophobia still up. I'm releasing like a second part to it called Stripped, where we're examining examining the effect of colonization on nudity. And not just like physical nudity, but like emotional, creative nudity and vulnerability. So that one will be released this Friday. And then mm. I'll probably be releasing a full webinar on these topics in April. So I'll let you know at the next live. Um, how do I make bubble comments what do you mean the Let ones at the top you. that show you that show your name when we feature it oh that's me just clicking on it that's me just clicking on it i'll make sure i click on you more the next time boo i will um <laughs> nikisha what do you have coming up girl i'm trying to ride alive i can't <laughs> <laughs> Nikisha, where you had it? I gotta go get these kids. I gotta get these oh. kids. I can't leave at the sitter all day. Woo. Okay. I'm gonna pick them up. Okay. I understand. But yes, I got stuff. I got some webinars popping off. We I talk about them in most episodes, and I'm trying to I'm trying to come up with my own stuff, my own stuff. So folks have been approaching me like, yo, we heard that webinar was amazing on mm. such and such a platform. Um, how can we get that? You know, another way. How can we get it directly from you? And I'm like. Mm. Hmm, Excellent question. Let me work on that. So mm -hmm. um, I'm working on that. Stay tuned. Yeah, you need to work on that so you can get the whole check. For us, by us. So you can get the, yeah, exactly, for us, by us. Uh, uh, Lydia said, look at this. I got to show this right quick before we get out of here. Lydia says, okay, but who is listed on the obituary? I've had a friend just go through this. Uh, go through this this year she didn't want the wife listed my friend is dating the married man but the married but separated man his father just passed I, I would say i you know it depends on how long they've been dating you may not have rights like that yet you know there's levels i don't know if you can you know, dictate. You know who did place the obituary who's ever the beneficiary on the insurance 
That's really who dictates it. Because if you don't let them dictate it, the funeral might then you not may get not get no money. You may not get no money. And I get a funeral. Alicia Michelle said, Nikki said, like I told y'all, I'm busy. <laughs> she did. She told us. She gets me. She, she gets, gets me. So yeah. we are going to wrap up. Thank you all for joining us. Um, I'm going to drop all the links that we mentioned uh, in, in the comments. So the Patreon link will be in there. Um, and Thea's Patreon link will be there. You can support, you know, both of us. You don't have to choose. You can support both. Um, you can get in for as little as $2 a month. Uh, I'll also drop the link for all the things that we're doing, the link for the, our, uh, our latest episode, and also for our merchandise. And if you want to make a one-time PayPal donation. And please share, share, share. Share this video. Um, we love with you all so much. Like, this is it's so much fun. Thank you. Our listenership has really taken off, and I know it's because um, of you all. So we are grateful. Like I always say, people don't have to listen. People don't have to comment. People don't have to show up. So I'm grateful, and I'm focused on whoever does. And so um, thank you all so much. Thank you for rocking with us tonight. This is pretty fun. This is pretty fun. Thank y'all. We will see y'all next month. Uh, we'll be doing this once a month, the second Sunday of every month. So we'll see you in April, anything else? You know what? That's it. Oh. I heard a church song today that I hadn't heard in a long time, but now I can't remember it. He is always. Oh. I was going to close out. I and I don't she actually the last, the last time I went to church. Actually, the last time I went to church. But but you know, the fire is shut up in my bones, and, and the word she, is buried in my heart. And then she goes to a southern accent. It's I it's do. Something, but wait, what's the song, Crystal? Um. Oh, you know what it is. There's a storm out over the ocean. Oh, that is and old. It's moving. That is like this one, one of way. the. That's so, one of the ten. One of the ten thousand ancestors brought it back. That's for real. Yo, so you know, not Q baby uh, sings Jesus. to the kids every night. He sings a. He sings a Negro spiritual to him every night, and that's that's Come one of the, the Negro list. spiritual. Then your that's soul one. may girl, yes, drift because away. I wait, get to drift trust. away, drift away. No, I got one older than you, but that the sign me up for the Christian Jubilee. Write my I name on the roll. You never heard? I've that? never even heard of that. I've never that's heard of that. That's how old that is. That's how old Did the that Ebo was. bring that one over? <laughs> I would like. Um, <laughs> came straight from. I don't remember that shit. That's right. I would like to say. That yes. clearly, clearly, my co-hosts are the more spiritual of us, because um, <laughs> while they have, you know, Negro spirituals and hymns placed on their spirit in this moment, she's she's waking up. Oh God, where is she? You broke up. I wanted to hear her song. It's I like know. Ratchet. She broke up. This the is devil so, is a liar. The devil is a liar. The devil is so busy. He's a liar and a hacker. <laughs> he's a liar and a hacker. And the truth is not in him. <laughs> she broke up. This is so horrible. Okay. Okay. We have to roll out, though. Oh, I wanted to hear her song. She's still talking, though. <laughs> tell her we can't hear her. If Should your I soul's know? not... Anchored in Jesus, you will know okay. truly drift away. You know okay. what I'm really good at? I'm good at the runs. I'm not good at the runs. Okay, I'm not good. I'd like it. Song Love with Go. Which one? Oh, okay, okay. to get you so what, what song? What was your song? I'm back. Okay. Okay. Yes. I was saying I didn't have not now song on my heart. I was mostly just thinking. Oh, well, y'all were being super spiritual. <laughs> y'all were being in touch with the Lord. What was on my heart was the final episode of Love After Lockup. <laughs> if y'all, I, mean, I thought I was the out. only one. I thought I was the only one. Okay, because I think that's going to be a great episode of Crystal series, where the yes. brother's in jail and he has several women out who are free who are supporting him. Yes, yes. And then he dies. Yes, yes. It's a complicated oh, funeral situation. Yes. Okay, we but can't you also get have the cousin yeah, who comes know. to the funeral in chat. In chain. Yes. Oh God, so yes. many ideas. Yes. That happened. Okay. All yeah. of that. Mm -hmm. This makes me want to watch the black version of Death at a Funeral. <laughs> that shit was hilarious. Okay. This so is, this is brilliant, and I can't wait to see where it goes. Thank but, you. I'm um, so excited. If anybody, if any of y'all watch Love After Lockup, I want to discuss with you. Okay. I, Let me know. I, I, Let I, us know I, if you well, watch Love watch After that. Lockup. Because... I don't watch it. I watch Locked Up Abroad, but yeah, it's always yeah. white people getting busted for drugs. It's fine. 
Um, okay, so we're going to head out. We've been on for about an hour. So please share, share, share. Nikisha's breaking up and still talking. Nikisha's breaking up and still talking. Okay, so please share, share, share. We love y'all. We, we go, Nikisha. We go. All I heard was we go. Yeah, we're gone. We love y'all. Thank y'all. Uh, that's all we got. We ain't got no more. We ain't more. got no more. All right. And we're out. Okay. Yeah. We are. We are. Okay. Nikisha, I'm sorry.